Okay, um, today I'm going to talk a little bit about the sound Y. Yeah, yeah, that sound. Uh, y is made by putting your tongue in the back and pushing off hard back there. Yeah, yeah, kind of squeezing against the back of your mouth, back of your molars, just with the back of your tongue. So the tip of your tongue isn't touching anywhere, it's just the, the back. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, most people can say that without too much of a problem. Some of the syllables can be a little harder though. So let's go through these syllables. We've got ya, yay, ye, yai, yo, you. And you can also do um, yay, ya, ye, ya, yai, ye, yo, ya, you, ya for doing the long and the short vowels. So most of them are pretty easy, although ye with the Y-E-E -E, can be a little harder because E, just the vowel sound itself, E, is produced with the tongue in the same place as the Y kind of goes. So it's hard to differentiate um, those two sounds and so when we're speaking, normally what we do is kind of punch that Y sound. Uh, not necessarily so much that it's obvious, but it has to be there. Ye, ye. You can feel the tongue tightening up and you can kind of hear it a little bit. Ye, ye, ye. So um, Try it out and see if you can hear the difference if I am covering up my mouth and see if you can hear the ye with the Y or E without the Y. Okay. Ye, Y. Ye, Y. E, E. E, E. Ye, Y. E, E. Ye, why? Ye, why? So, did you hear the difference? Um, hopefully, you could hear the difference. And what you want to do is be able to hear the difference yourself, too, so that you can, when you are speaking, you want to be able to hear the difference as you are speaking so that you know whether you're doing it right or not. So, you can um, record a little dialogue. Ye, 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 whatever it is. Um, have it written out so that you can then compare it a day later or so when you go and listen to it and, and then mark down what you think you heard and see if it matches up with your original transcript of what you recorded. So then you can know whether, uh, I made that not quite right or yes, I made those correctly. So... Uh, y versus no Y. Ye, E. Wait, let me make them the same pitch so that you can tell for sure. Ye, <clears throat> ye, e, ye, e, ye, e. Those were all Y, E, Y, E, Y, E. So very important to get that Y sound because... Um, if you don't say it, it could change the whole word. For instance, year and ear. Year as in 12 months of the year, a whole year. And ear as in what you hear sounds with, ear. Year, ear. Let me make them the same pitch. Year, ear, year, ear, year, ear, year, ear. ear. Ear, year, ear, year, ear, year, ear. It's a very, very subtle, slight difference, but it's there. And um, you have to be able to make that difference so that people can understand what you're saying. So there's the Y sound, year, ear, year. Um, practice that and good luck.